This is a tutorial on how to replace an Acer Aspire 1 uh, laptop screen. Uh, as you can see, this is an Acer Aspire 1. The model number is listed here. It's Acer Aspire 1 D270-1806. And as you can see, the screen is clearly broken. So what I've gone and done is uh, bought a replacement screen off of LaptopScreens.com and I'm going to show you how to replace it. So first things first, just make sure you turn off your laptop and when you do, remove the battery. You want to make sure your laptop has no power. Alright, here in the corners you've got these two circles. You're going to want to uh, take your screwdriver or an exacto knife or something similar and pop these out. You can have two screws in both the holes that you're going to want to unscrew and that'll let you take this plastic piece off. So when you're taking the plastic piece off you can force it, it's not going to break even though it might feel like it. Just bend it down to take it all the way out. Here we see the under uh, wiring and of the uh, screen and other components of the computer. So what we're going to do now is take these screws over here, four on each side, and unscrew them. And I'll get back to you then. So I've just finished unscrewing the final screw of the eight. After I unscrewed these two, or these four screws, the laptop essentially became two halves. That's fine, you can put it flat down like this. So what we're going to be doing now is uh, removing a few cables so that we can lift up the screen. The last cable uh, to remove is this one here. It's for the webcam and all you need to do is put a flat screwdriver in like this and carefully remove this, uh, these, this wire. Now you're going to be able to lift up your laptop or the screen and flip it over on, its op on the opposite side. So if you have any tape here, that can just be removed very easily. Peel it off and uh, pull these wires, pull these wires out. Now you can peel this wire off of the screen. This is going to be an essential wire so that you can hook up your new screen. The old one, of course, is garbage and it can be set aside. Here we have the uh, laptop uh, screen that came in from LaptopScreens.com uh, and all you're going to have to do now is connect this uh, to all the wires we just removed and then uh, close up the laptop. Alright, so first things first, we're putting back in the wire uh, into the uh, actual screen. So this can just be uh, forced in like that. And if you have that tape again, you can just uh, set it back down. This wiring, uh, you can just line up again how it was before. And same with the webcam wire. Just stick it back on like that. We're going to flip this back over now. Set it down. And again with the uh, webcam wire, just put it back in the slot. Again, you can use your uh, screwdriver or some other object to help push it back in. Alright, so now we've got the uh, 
new laptop screen uh, in and all we need to do is screw in uh, the eight screws that we uh, removed earlier and then cover it back up. So I'll uh, screw those in and get back to you in a moment. Okay, I'm almost done uh, screwing all the eight screws in, back in uh, and then we're going to be covering up the laptop uh, back with the plastic piece. So if you notice that any of the uh, components come out at any point, like say there's a microphone here, if it comes out of the slot, just make sure you push it back in. Just ensure that everything's uh, in the uh, proper spot, or at least it looks proper. So we can stand our laptop back up. And now we can place this uh, plastic cover back on. So you're probably going to want to bend your laptop as far back as it'll go and then just snap this in. You should be able to hear it snap all the way around and including this middle area here. And uh, now what you're going to want to do is put those two screws back in here and uh, behind this uh, other circle and if you can uh, try and put the circles back on. Sometimes they lose their stickiness and they might not want to go back on but uh, try your best and they and they should go back in all right good as new let's see if it works that's right we need to put the battery back in so we'll do that now and then turn it on and see if it works Perfect. Screen is fixed. Once again, the screen was bought at laptopscreens.com. Uh, they serve they serve both uh, American and Canadian customers, and uh, uh, the delivery was pretty quick within a few days. And the uh, setup, the actual time I took to install, uh, replace the screen was about 10 or 15 minutes. It's very simple. You don't have to be a computer to know it all or anything like that to. Uh, do it. It's a very simple installation. So good luck and hopefully you found this useful.